Hi there you guys, I'm Teddy from Bijuteo Beading and in today's tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to make these beautiful diamond shaped dangling earrings. They're easy to make and I'll show you step by step so I'm sure by the end of this tutorial you're going to be able to make them by yourself. If you want to support me it's a good idea to subscribe and also hit the bell button to be notified for my new absolutely free upcoming videos for fresh beading ideas. Thank you so much for watching, now I will start with the list of the materials. Ok guys, so what I'm using for this video are 8 o beads in silver color and I use here 10 o seed beads in black color, I'm sure you could use 11 o's with this work. Ok, and here I use ear wires. These are two beads that are really beautiful, you could use any type of beads or pearls you like. These are 10 mm beads. And here I use monofilament that is 0.006 inches or 0.15 millimeters. This is size 10 beading needle scissors. And these are flat nose pliers. They are not obligatory. Only if you need to go through the difficult beads, you could use them. Okay, and now I'm going to take about 3 feet of thread on my needle, which is about 90 centimeters. And I'll be back. Okay, guys, and now here in my first step, what I'm going to take are four of these beautiful atos. Okay, and I have four here. And I'm going to slide those down. I will stick my needle in my mat and here what I want to do is make a knot. Okay. I'm making here a knot by making a loop and going twice through the loop I've made. You could go three times if you want. And then I'm making one more knot and pulling. Then I go through the following silver just like this. And I'm taking one black bead and go through the following silver. One more black, tenno, go here. And I'm going to repeat this two more times. Okay, and I'm taking three beads. I'm exiting out of this black one. Taking three and I'm going back in circle through this one bead here, making a cross of four. Okay, you see? Making a cross of four. Okay, and pull. Then I'm going through the silver and through the following black just like this and I'm taking three black beads and I'm going back in circle through this black one like this then through the silver and through the black okay and take three Okay, and go through the silver and through the black one. Okay, then three more. Okay, and go here. Like this. Then I'm going through the silver and through the black one. Okay. And I will flip my work because it's easier for me. Now I, I'm exiting out of this black one. It's easier for me because I'm right-handed, but if you're left-handed, you might prefer the other direction. Okay, and now I'm exiting out of this black one. And I'm going to take six atos. Okay, I have my six atos here. And I'm going back here through this black one. Then I'm going through the first silver. Take just one black. Go through the silver. One more. Go here. One more, go here, 
one more okay now here and this is what I have guys a beautiful circle of beads okay now what I do is that I go through this black one here and through the following black like this through the one that I added first and now it's easier for me to flip my work again okay like this and my goal is to exit out of this black bead okay and I'm going through the silver and through the next black 11 all then through the following two black beads just like this and I will repeat these steps here take six go back then repeat those steps Okay, and now guys, you know what I need to do. I need to go through this black bead here and I want to reach this bead that's sticking out the most, okay? I'm going here, just like this. And then I go through these two black beads. And I'm going to repeat this process two more times here and here and I'll be back to tell you what's coming up next. Okay guys, and now I'm finishing this element here. I did it the same way like I did the previous two. And now in this step I'm exiting out of this black bead. The first one after the cross, okay? And here what I want to take are four seed beads and I'm going in the same black bead here the first one after this cross okay adding four if you work with 11 also you could add five here at this step now I'm working with 10 os okay and I will go with through the silver and through the black And here I want to take four, okay, four beads, and I will go through this bead here. The same bead, symmetrically the same bead, from my neighbor element, okay. I have this. Now I will go through the silver and through the black, okay, like this. And I need to add four, okay, four, go through this first bead here, okay, then I go through the silver and through the following black, like this, and the last four beads. Okay guys, and what I do next is that I go around one more time through this thread pad because I want my beads to stay in a nice shape like this. Okay, I'll do this off camera and I'll be back to tell you what's coming up next. Okay, and I went around through all of my beads like this in this direction. And now what I do is that I go here through this silver one and here and now here and I'm exiting out of this black bead that is just the opposite of this cross here. And now I'm going to attach my ball here, 
that will be dangling at my earring okay and in order to do this I'm taking four leg beads okay four and I want to go through this beautiful bowl you see it has a lot of holes and I should go through the central hole you could use any type of bead you like round or in different shape it doesn't matter as long as it has a hole here at the middle okay and I will take three beads okay three more here I'm taking four then three more I will slide those down and then I will skip those three beads and go through the central hole of the bowl Okay, like this and I pull now in my next step I want to go through three of these black beads or these four beads that I added okay three of them and I'm taking one black bead okay and I'm going through the first one okay now I have this and you could leave it like this, but I will go one more time down through this bowl. Okay. Just like this. Okay, and through this tree here. Okay, then I will go through these speeds in this direction, and here. I want to reach this part. I will go through all of my beads in this direction. Because I want to reach the other part where I want to attach my ear wire. Okay. If you can't do this in one movement to go through as many beads as you like, do it in two, three or more movements. Okay guys, and now I'm exiting here at the opposite part of my earring okay and I will attach my ear wire here okay you see where I am and in order to do this I will take my ear wire just like this and I will take one black bead then my ear wire then one more black bead okay here it is and then I'm going back in circle through this earring. Okay, and here I want to make a knot between those two beads. I'm making a loop and I'm going once and I'm going second time. Then I pull and you could repeat this knot several more times. And when you're ready, go through the following seed bead never cut next to a knot but always go through the following seed bead and then cut your thread okay my diamond shape earring is ready okay guys and now my dangling diamond shape earrings are ready so if you like them and you want to see more and more videos like this it's a good idea to subscribe and hit the bell button and in this way you will be notified when i release matching jewelry to the ones that i have already done like I have a tutorial for a matching bracelet and I'm linking it here so you could check it out. If you want to support me, you could also like, share and comment and you don't know how much you help me only with this action. And if you make beautiful jewelry following my tutorials, please share them on my Facebook page that I posted below this video. I will be so happy to see your creations. Down there in description, you will find a full list of materials Links where you could buy supplies from, link to my store and link for PayPal donations to develop this channel. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye from me.